look lost. What do you need? Oh, a picture of the outside. Ridiculous. This elevator isn't operational. Everyone knows that it is impossible to leave this place. Well, except the outsiders. But they're all gone now, except Momo. You can try to talk to him if you want, but he gave up on trying to leave. It's for the best. He lives high up in that building with the orange neon sign. Hesitate me to don't hesitate me. Don't hesitate to call me anytime I'm here to help. The guardian told us to talk to Momo up in the big building with the orange neon sign. He's the only lead we've got for getting out of here. Sleep. That's cute. You gave us such a fright, we thought you were a Zerk. Ooh, very pretty. Take the elevator? I've never seen that thing work and I'll be 374 years old tomorrow. I like this guy. If you bring him music, he'll play for you. Hello, I'm a musician, but I don't have any songs. Remarkable. Companions have evolved so much. In the early days, their simple AI merely imitated human art. Now this is all their own. Humans often said that making art is important in desperate situations. These are certainly desperate times. Spider-Man, Super Spirit Laundry, Grandma Clothing, Elliot Brothers. Looking for someone capable of monitoring the southern entrance to the safe zone. The Marie Remuneration is two pints of Cuba oil per day. Please contact the party. Yeah, I'll meet you. So if today is yesterday's tomorrow, tomorrow will be yesterday's today. Right? Time is weird. We don't age like our soft one ancestors. We are trapped here forever. Very pretty. It would be so nice if it was real. Oh. Grandma 
I do love knitting. So far I've knitted 478 miles of scarves. It's something to do. If you bring me some electrical cable, I could make you a poncho. You inspire me, but it's not easy to find the right materials around. That's very pretty. It looks a bit peculiar to be real though. Grandma made me this one. It's pretty stylish, no? You want something? Oh, you're one of those outsiders like Momo. Well, good luck with that. Hey, it's you. You do look weird and small, but there's something about you. I feel compelled to pet you, but I won't because I don't understand why. The surface? Oh, it's a sensitive subject around here. There are some whose code can understand that concept. There are ones who know about the outside, but are too resigned to do anything. And then there's the outsiders. You can imagine how they feel. Well, there's only Momo. slide here. Circles of light are pleasing to watch, but I want to see the real sky one day.
is never going to work. Why did I let them go? I'm all alone now. Hey, what do you want? This is a picture of the outside. Do you want to go there? Well, don't bother. It's a waste of time. It will bring you only loneliness and despair. My friends had this dream too, but now they're gone and I'm all alone. I don't know where they ended up. I tried to contact them, but that beep transceiver doesn't work. My friends and I took notes of our research about the outside. Here, take mine if you really want to go out there. You're on your own. I'm done with the outside. Good luck. Momo seems very sad. He misses his friends. Let me check the notebook he gave us. The Outsider's Manifesto. We must go outside at any cost. We must protect our brothers and sisters. We must stay away from Zerks. The sign Clementine, Balthazar, Doc, and Momo. Looks like Momo's name was added later. I think we should find the other notebooks. Excuse me while I rip up your carpet. I could put a bag on my head. Oh, it inverts the controls. Back home too, I remember this video game. It was made just after I was created, I think. I can't remember it well. Scientists and I spent a lot of time playing it. It was fun, I miss it. Why can't I remember his name? Just the one on the notebook. Seems like a lead. Everything over, be a menace. Outsider notebook. It's the same logo as the one Momo gave us. This one seems to belong to someone named Clementine. Excuse me. Everything is going according to plan. We managed to contact the upper level before the transceiver went down. They are in a place called Midtown and apparently it's controlled by some kind of oppressive force. I talked to Momo earlier. His eyes. I know this look. He will not come with us. Let's find the other notebooks.
Hey Doc, I found the keys to your safe. You need to be more careful with these. Not enough to bury your safe behind a bunch of books, just a library. develop your artificial intelligence in order to be as creative as a real human, volume 42. Could sleep amongst the books. I didn't find that one before, I don't think. Nice work, another notebook. This one seems to belong to someone named Doc. After weeks of research, I've combined a spectrometer with a powerful UV lamp. This we should be able we should be capable of warding off the Zerks on our way out. The initial attempt was explosive. I might have to test it under real conditions. Let's find the other one. Congratulations, power supply. <laughs> Thank you. 
Finally, the last notebook. This one seems to belong to someone named Balthazar. Thank you for the lurk! All traces of organic life has disappeared except for what we call the Zerks. They seem to eat almost anything that moves and breed at an inconceivable rate. The being locked in the city wasn't hard enough. Oh! There's also a note in this book. I found a design flaw in the transceiver, but I think I figured out how to fix it. Here's the equation. With this, we should be able to help Momo repair the transceiver. If I could communicate with the upper levels, that could be our way up. Let's show them what we found. Hey little cat, are you still looking for those useless notebooks? It's not the buyer's notebook. Balthazar's notebook, right? I never quite understood what he was talking about most of the time. He was very wise. Oh, it belonged to Doc. He was really a huge nerd for electronics and stuff. He was always on the verge of a great discovery. Wait, you've actually found all my friends? No books? Oh, what's that note? The transceiver can be repaired. This is incredible. That means we should be able to communicate outside of the slums. Come and sign Balthazar Doc. I'm sorry I doubted our cause. I promise you all I'll find a way to reach the surface. Thank you. We might be able to find you a way up. Now let's fix this piece of junk transceiver. <laughs> it, voila! it works! Come with me. Up there, see that building high above the others? If you install the transceiver at the very top of the tower, we should be able to communicate with the whole city. My friends might still be out there. If there's a way out, they'll know it. You're the only one small and quick enough to evade the Zerks. We need you, little outsider. Bring us to the sky. I love the little bucket. <laughs> little cat in the bucket. It's so cute. 